February 25th and Charles and I are on our way to Miami uh, because tomorrow we leave for a seven day cruise to Mexico, Honduras, and the Bahamas. We are so, so excited. Um, I'll be going with uh, my family in North Carolina, see my god kids, and just spend a really nice time together and do some excursions and spend time with Charles. Yeah. And we're just so excited. So, I don't know if you want to add anything. Uh, we're 39 minutes away from Miami to see To see Charles Emily, cousins. yeah. My um, cousins Emily and Brian and my aunt and uncle. So spend some time with them, stay the night, and then they'll drop us off at the port. So stay tuned. It's going to be a really fun trip. I'm so excited to um, vlog as much as I can and yeah, record the experience. So stay tuned. This is our room. We got a king bed. Storage. I think this is a fridge. Oh nice. If we get like a little snack. A fridge. We got this. A little chair. A nice great closet perfect storage for all of our stuff awesome and then oh nice this is a nice bathroom and then this is a bathroom really cute what? this is so cool we just got on oh my god already yeah we haven't been on the ship for more than 30 minutes, baby. Now day two, we're in Coco Cay, um, Royal Caribbean's island in the Bahamas. We met up for breakfast in the dining room and then Charles and I split off. We went to the gym real quick, which was, it was nice. Like it's a pretty decent gym, but I was surprised how many people were there. So I kind of had to wait for a spot like uh, to get a mat on the floor. And then we, I walked on the treadmill and it had these really nice windows overlooking the water. So it was really nice. And now we're going to go meet up with our, <coughs> bless you. We're gonna go meet up with our family that should have a spot now, hopefully on the beach. Apparently it fills up quickly and there's another ship here. So I don't know, hopefully we've got a space on the beach and we're gonna play some hopefully competitive beach volleyball and spike ball later. So to be continued and follow along. We made it, we're it's here, so Coco. cute. Yay. It's very nice, the water is beautiful. Are you building a castle? No, we're, we're right now we're trying to keep it together. Oh no. Keep it. And I'm making the water wet. James, what are you working on? The castle. How are you, we're, we're building a castle. <laughs> Why is it breaking? Because it's a crack. Oh no, we have to fill up the crack. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. Good job, baby. Were you scared? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. <laughs> How was it? Huh? How was it? It was fun. <laughs> you scared? No. Are you excited? Yeah, I am. Let's see how long I can stay up for. Today is day four on the cruise. We got up at 6 a.m. because we had a very early excursion and it was all day. Our excursion was um, the Mayan ruins and then also seeing the cenotes. And it was really fun. So yeah, we got up super early. Um, we landed in Cancun. So from Cancun, we had to take a ferry into Playa de Carmen. Yeah, Playa de Carmen. And then from there, we had to take a bus uh, to the Mayan ruins. We had a tour there, then we got to walk around a little bit. That's strong. And from there, we took a bus to the cenotes, which were really cool. And I'll put some clips here um, of what the cenotes look like. We were able to um, swim. Yeah, swim inside like an open cenote, which honestly reminded me a lot of a spring in Florida. And then I jumped. And I yeah, jumped and Charles the, jumped, so I'll also put that here. It's a little ledge. It was probably like, what, 10, 15 uh, feet? 15 feet. Fif or 13.4. That's what it said. And from there, uh, we did an underground cenote, which was really cool. If our tour guide didn't have a flashlight, we probably would not have been able to see anything. We went and, into a rock. <laughs> yeah, and he scared us. There was like a puma, like a fake statue puma that they put in there that was super scary. Um, <laughs> some people definitely were not expecting that. We weren't. And yeah, so then from there, we basically came back, you know, take the bus ride back and then the ferry back to Cancun and we hopped on our boat right on time. We had to change immediately to get to dinner on time and then just spent the rest of the night uh, doing different activities that they had. They have live Latin dance music. Um, the, if you... 80s, guess 80s, the 80s. Guess the 80s tune. Uh, they played like one to three seconds of a song and then you have to guess it. Face. We're back. We are getting packed and ready for tomorrow. We'll be in Honduras, Roatan, Honduras, and we'll be snorkeling. So I'm super excited about that. I love snorkeling, and um, I think we're going to be at a beach after that. So that's pretty much it for day four. And on to day five. We just went snorkeling 
and come here. And it was really fun. We got to see so many cool corals, different fish. Mm -hmm. um, apparently there was a barracuda. I didn't I miss see it that. Too. But it was super nice. And now we're hanging out at like this little beach spot. You so yeah. So now we're going to enjoy our empanadas. And they call it pastelitos. Oh, they're pastelitos, that's right. We're chilling at the beach. The beach. It's really hot. so much. <laughs> I'm building so much. I'm building character right now. Oh, there you go. oh thank you. I love you. This is Charles's first time eating escargot. Tastes like chicken? Tastes like squid. Oh, there you go. You good? I'm a fan. I'm surprised. To the place I belong. West Virginia. My mama. Take me Because yesterday it was way too rocky for us to be able to dock the boat and get off safely and it ended up being super um, like wavy the boat was rocking I got super nauseous so I probably had breakfast I went to maybe an event or two and then um, Charles and I were in the room for pretty much the rest of the day till dinner which it's nice we have an early dinner at 530 and then we from there I think it got a little bit better it was still rocky but it wasn't as bad it was as it was earlier in the day so we danced we did like Latin dance hung out with our family just the events that they have on the cruise and I'll insert any clips if I have them um, from yesterday and then And then today, um, thankfully we got up and it was not rocky at all. So we got up, had breakfast. It's my godson James' birthday. Um, so I'll put videos uh, we have of him just around the ship. I know we went to the um, carnival area. I think it's called Boardwalk. And um, his grandma Becky got him cotton candy that he had for the first time. And I think he really liked it. Um, Charles joined the sexy man, the sexiest man competition. So I'll definitely insert clips of that. Uh, that was so funny. 
um, <laughs> for, I figured there was going to be a variety of people that joined that, so it was really fun to watch him do that and cheer him on. Um, so he did that, and then um, there was just like tons of stuff going around down the boardwalk. They were giving out these really good like chocolate cake pops. Oh my gosh, they were delicious. Um, then we, Charles and I, went to hang out at the pool for a little bit. Um, our family went to go see Cats, which I think is like a musical. And we were just like really hot, so we wanted to go to the pool and just relax. And it was really cool. We sat at like a really nice balcony area. Um, I think it was in like the solarium area. So it overlooked the water, and that was really, really pretty. And yeah, so now we came back, we're getting ready for dinner. We have a few surprises we want to put together for James for his birthday. So we're going to go early and help um, our waiter Anthony and Carla set up the table uh, to surprise James when they show up at 5.30. And that's pretty much it. And then I'll put in videos of what we do for the rest of the night. Happy birthday dear James. That is all that, James. Happy birthday. You're a little bigger than the first time I met you. <laughs> Just a little bit. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Last night after dinner, we took some family pictures. Um, we saw the final karaoke like song competition and then Charles and I went to go dance some salsa because there was live salsa music and we were exhausted after like 11 so or 12 uh, 12 yeah after like two days yeah at midnight so yeah we only danced like two songs and we came back but it's officially time to go we're all packed we had the nicest time I know we'll definitely do a cruise here again, probably go to some other ports and places, but that was so, so nice, and I'm going to miss it. That's it for this um, adventure. Stay tuned for more, and yeah, thanks for watching all the way through, and hope you enjoyed it. Bye!